And right off the bat of U.S. President Trump's state visit to Seoul, South Korean President Moon Jae-in also embarks another of his Asia trip today. President Moon will visit three Southeast Asian nations for a series of bilateral summits and regional forums. Our Hwang Ho-jun with details at the Blue House. South Korean President Moon Jae-in embarks on his eight-day trip to three Southeast Asian nations on Wednesday. He will be visiting Indonesia, Vietnam and the Philippines for bilateral summits and regional forums. His first stop, Jakarta, Indonesia, which is the largest importer of South Korean arms, will be his first ever state visit since taking office. President Moon's bilateral summit with his Indonesian counterpart, Joko Widodo, will take place on Thursday at the Presidential Palace in Bogor, about 60 kilometers away from the Indonesian capital. In addition to the summit, President Moon will take part in a forum of roughly 300 business leaders from the two countries, dubbed the South Korea-Indonesia Business Roundtable and Summit. It is expected that he'll use the opportunity to introduce his administration's so-called New South policy, which seeks to improve diplomatic and economic ties between Seoul and its Southeast Asian neighbors. On Friday, President Moon will fly over to Da Nang, Vietnam, to attend the 25th Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation Forum, where Seoul's chief diplomat is set to introduce his country's key economic policy initiative of people-oriented sustainable growth. The forum will involve officials and leaders from 20 other member economies, including President Trump, who had just visited Seoul on Tuesday. And on the sidelines of the APEC meeting, a bilateral summit is due to be held between President Moon and his Chinese counterpart Xi Jinping. On Sunday, the South Korean leader will head to his final destination, Manila in the Philippines, to attend the East Asia Summit and the 20th ASEAN Plus Three Heads of Government Summit. A one-on-one -on -one with Chinese Prime Minister Li Keqiang is also expected to take place on the sidelines of the ASEAN Forum. Hwang Wojun, Arirang News.